Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more EU4. And uh, we are playing as Ulm, going for our Ulmayed Caliphate campaign. It's going to happen. I know that like we this happened like 30, 40 years ago, and then it just nothing has happened since then. Right now, we are doing the war that is going to allow us to take Parma. And then that will allow us to annex Lekka, which will then allow us to annex Tlemcen, which will allow us to really start working our way down here. And we actually... Tunis is not allied to the Ottoman, so I'm going to say I want all of this stuff down here, and that means that you need to get some claims down there, Tlemcen, because I can't do any of that, so we're just going to wait. Uh, looks like these guys are actually getting a little frisky, so we're going to go ahead and have you guys pop out there. Um, let's go ahead and not waste a bunch of manpower, though, if we don't need to, and uh, sounds good to me. So, you are at war with who? Just me now? No, yeah, and Castile. Why is it not set showing up? There we go. Oh yeah, no, you guys are in trouble. <laughs> we'll win their capital siege eventually. Maybe, we'll see. So they are gonna siege down some stuff up there. That's annoying, but uh, it's not an issue. It, it'll be fine. Hire the engineer for mill points? Yes, please. We have a mill idea, so let's go ahead and... Ah, uh, uh, we can't switch over quite yet, but that's fine. This guy's old, and he's got Craven. which is just so annoying, but that's fine. I do not need you guys to attach to me, though. Gonna definitely need to get up there. So let's go ahead and get you guys grouped up, and come on up there. Uh, so he is the only guy sieging. Nah, Salzburg is on there. Unfortunate. That's fine. Let's go ahead and get you guys out of there. Give me all that trade power, and then give me all your money. Wonderful. Pay off my debts. And uh, there you go. We are at war in order to uh, make money. So, gotta love it. So let's go ahead up here, get you guys off these forts. And uh, I will be annexing this. And this is all that we're going to take. So it looks like Alsace, maybe. Let's go ahead and improve some relations with some, some of these guys who would otherwise be joining our coalition. I get a lot of complaints about my lazy diplomats, so I'm going to try to not have lazy diplomats then. There you go. Okay, election in the despotism. 633 or a 41... So that's uh, 12, and this one is only 10. But I would like the extra mil. I just hope I don't get the 241. 63 is fine. I'll take that. Um, so we are now a uh, plutocracy again. We just get to switch every once in a while. Um, let's go ahead and collect over here as well. That's kind of funny. We get to collect in a bunch of different nodes. It's definitely not, like, ideal, I don't think, but I don't really care either. Go ahead and kill them off in Ulm. No, it's not ideal, but that's fine. And now we can just speed five it because we don't have any real enemies left in the war. And uh, we will take this. This is what we're going to do. As far as coalition goes, Venice, Genoa. Hmm, Genoa is our rival now. Or at least they rivaled me, I think. No. They just really hate me, which is fine. That's understandable as well. So let's go ahead and um, Milan will be gone. Mantua. Let's see if we can improve with them. Oh, yeah, totally. So we won't get a coalition. That's wonderful. Let's go ahead and just go stand on Salzburg, and that will probably actually make them want to peace out. Wonderful. Let's go right there. Peace out Salzburg, which will then probably allow us to take our piece here. No, it will not, which is fine. We're just going to have to run on over to... Uh, you guys are just trying to get your army home, which is fine. I have no reason to not let you there. Let's get over to Dubrovnik. Oh, they're actually getting siege down right now. Okay. I suppose we're good to just hang out then. Where are those rebels at? Nah, they're just peasants for you. I don't care particularly. Let's see if we can catch you guys out over here. Very good. They want out now. And uh, free traders or... That's fine. 
We need a king. Uh, yeah, sounds good to me. I kind of want a king. I don't know if I'm like just waiting on an event to happen or what. Um, go. Wonderful. I will core you up. I can create a trading city now. Really? Because I'm an oligarchy. Ah, interesting. So let's go ahead. Oh, we have to core this first. Dang it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, and now we are a despotism again. And now we cannot create a uh, trading city, which is hilarious. So Bavaria has broken their alliance with us. Well, why is that? Why would you do that? Because they switched over to a different religion. Eh. I will go ahead and rival you. I definitely need to make sure that uh, Austria really likes me. Truce with England is over, which is fine. I need to keep Austria. As long as Austria is my friend, I'm not going to get attacked, which is uh, ideal. I don't really care about you, actually. So let's go ahead. Whenever this core is done, we'll be able to core or annex Lekka. I might actually be able to annex these guys after. It's hard to say. Mm, I might be able to. If I don't have to annex Lekka, I'm not going to. Like, not right now, at least. Arrange the ball. Yes, please. Let's go ahead and build some more stuff to get some more monies. Um, oh, we can lose some Diplo. I don't mind that. Look at this. 460 manpower a month. And we're not even behind on Diplo tech. It's wonderful. It's a wonderful, beautiful thing. We are getting very close to being able to... Um, to annex um, Tlemcen, which is beautiful. Our manpower is looking so good. We can actually go ahead and uh, build up. Um, I'm, I'm actually going to put a couple of cannons in our in our army, if you can believe that, when we can afford them. There we go. Almost done with our core. The moment of truth is if I can annex Tlemcen or if I have to annex Lekka first. We'll see. Truce with Portugal is over. Let's go ahead and get you as well. Castile is done. So I wonder, actually. Yeah, England would help him with reconquest. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What happened here? We have two provinces that I didn't have before. What happened? Was liberated, occupied by rebels. No way! Rebels? Haha! <laughs> I love that. Yeah, that's cool. That is wonderful. Alright, so anyways, let's see here. We'll go ahead and grab this last guy there. And the moment of truth. Can I, can I, can I? I cannot. Feels bad, man. That's fine. Let's go ahead and annex them. It's gonna take us like a couple months. Um, we have our Diplo rep guy. Trustworthy allies would be nice. Um, we don't have two allies, do we? Yep, just Austria. <laughs> I want to keep Baden. Eh, maybe. I don't know. I mean, I don't really need Baden, but I'll keep him for now. It's fine. So we can make states, but I'm not going to. And then, have you gotten claims? You've gotten zero claims, which is annoying because they are not defended at all. Just with Savoy is over. Are they still my rival? They are not, sadly. Max out that manpower recovery speed. Execute the troublemakers or uh, monies. Well, so here's a nice little thing you can do here. Uh, there you go. I will go ahead and... Uh, dang it. Oh, the reason why... Oh, it keeps on popping back and forth because of the, uh, the switches. Ah, okay. I didn't know that. Let's go ahead and uh, do what we can with you guys. I'll go ahead and give you another one there. I will take that, and then I will take you, and then I will give the nobility those guys, those guys there. We'll call a diet. We will do that. We will do that, and we will take the mill points so we can keep on tech and not fall behind. 
Um, and then I will go ahead and give this one to the clergy. And I think that might actually even be enough. Let's see here. Seek support. Yeah, we need 40, so that's fine. So let's go ahead and give you that. And uh, do a couple of these clicks here and take the admin points and we will turn right around and immediately sync those admin points into stuff that is worth spending on. And we get more money from it anyway, so it's all good, man. It is all good, man. And uh, let's go ahead and build these buildings. Okay. So they have forced somebody to break an alliance with somebody. Did you get some claims down there, man? I'm about to no CB them. <laughs> so annoying. Diplotech or Diplo points, nice. Let's go ahead and uh, spend a couple of those points, right? There we go. We're making so much money right now. Yeah, it's fine with me. Naples and Venice, huh? Man, Castile is really getting into Italy. We're gonna definitely need to handle that. And we will, it'll be fine. Somebody wants to hire Condottieri. Let's have a, uh, let's see if Pope Man wants them. They're not willing to give me a whole lot of money though. These guys are, but I don't wanna rent out my army because then my guys will be disloyal. There you go, production's good. Collecting five ducats here. We lost our trader over there. Very good. I just can't believe this dude hasn't gotten any claims. Did I not mark this as vital interest? I did. Hmm. I would like to maybe get a couple of the islands from these guys so I can get some claims over there, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. It's fine. Oh, the speed five. So much speed five. We'll make it work. We could totally increase our trade power here as well. Pay money for burger loyalty, and but they gain influence, so that's fine, I suppose. So we can totally still get this, so I'm going to do that. Um... I think we'll take Miltech. Infantry Shock. Eh, it's okay. It's not nothing. Integration is a slow process, and then we're going to immediately begin annexing these guys as soon as they'll allow us. So France is at war with the Ottomans yet again. Albania and Ramazan broke free, so I wonder if the Ottomans lost the war. Okay. This is good though. If France gets beat beat up on just even a little bit, it's going to be really good for us because we're going to be able to uh, get them annexed or go ahead and attack Genoa, which would be great. Glorious will be Ulm. I love that. I love that. So let's go ahead and get a uh, national unrest is fine. Kind of worthless, but it's okay. <laughs> I'll take it. Um, embrace the Counter Reformation. Nah, don't care about the Counter Reformation. Advancements of Religion Act, that's fine. Let's go ahead and start annexing these guys. This will be done. It's gonna take quite some time, sadly, because of our bad uh, Diplo reputation, because of annexing our other subjects. But that's fine, so our Statesman is dead. We're gonna immediately hire another one. Truce with Ragusa is over. So let's see here, do we want a war with anybody else? We do, but uh, I don't know who we want a war with. Genoa would be a good one, I think. So let's go ahead and get a war with Genoa started if we can. Lithuania and France will join. Look at Hungary is uh, Moldavia. Nice. We'll see what's going on. I basically need to wait to see if France gets uh, beat up on in this war. 
So he's got a lot of manpower right now. We're actually going to top out at about 50,000, which is really good. Um, this is going to be tough getting switched over here. Um, for some reason, oh, this is Catholic, yes. Uh, and so the problem is, is we do have a decent amount of dev up here. Um, let's see how much dev we actually do have. So we have 264 dev. And if those rebels won't teleport over there, then I actually don't know what that's going to do for us. So let's go ahead and actually have you guys protecting trade in Genoa. Or not Genoa. Protecting trade in uh, Venice. And these guys, we can have you guys um, hunting pirates in Genoa. There we go. We use five sailors each month, which is dumb. But apparently we do. We will wait until next month. Bit of a speed five episode, but it's fine, guys. This will all play out well in the end for us. Free prestige is nice. How long will this last for... 38, so still eight more years, unfortunately. So what's going on with you, France? So they're up, they have gained manpower now. Hmm. They're actually not too far off from saying no, though. Oh my gosh, Ottomans, what are you doing, dude? Let's go ahead and take that. Go ahead and make sure we're always sinking our mill points into manpower if we can. Palatinate has collapsed. So they have a new, uh, uh, I wonder if they were still in their uh, personal union. I'm not sure, actually. Uh, so let's go ahead and relax with our money, I suppose. Plevs, uh, I don't care about their opinion of me. Basically, as soon as France will not help out, that's uh, that's when I need to attack. So they're actually really liking me. They would make a good friend because we could use them to beat up on Castile, which would be wonderful. The only problem is, is that we'd have to choose them or Austria, and Austria is still the emperor. Um, it's hard to say. France is also allied to. Venice, which is unfortunate. So they're getting close. They're getting very close. Platinate. That's fine. Everybody can run through my land. I don't mind. Let's go ahead and get you guys down there. Should have been drilling, admittedly. They allied Switzerland. So France is not going to join here if we wait just like two more months. One more, two more. There we go. France will not join. Switzerland will. I don't care. Lithuania, I don't care. And the Knights definitely do not care. So let's go ahead and get you guys down there with like half our men over here. Oh no. Our fleet. Our poor fleet. Feels bad, man. Oh, hey, they didn't die. Wonderful. All right, let's go ahead and go back to speed, uh, whatever this is. I don't need these guys, probably. Yeah, we'll keep them. That's fine. Let's go ahead and have you guys head over there. So... We definitely don't want to have our, um... Dude, sieging down, getting sieged down. Um, yeah, let's come on over here. We don't need our cannons to fight these guys. Let's go ahead and uh, head on up there. We just want to siege down, you know. I'm probably not going to take it. It's more going to be about the disrespect. We are rival to them, I believe. Are we not? No, we're not. Eh, it's fine. We'll see what we can come up with over here. Did they finish their war already? Immediately after he dishonored the call? I love that. 
So that is another Von Hopsburg. Go ahead and improve with the Franks just in case. Okay. Got a wall breach. Wonderful. And I don't know where his army is. I... So there's 40,000 men somewhere, mostly in Lithuania. That's fine. Let's go ahead and uh, switch over to a defensiveness edict. That's going to be pretty good for us over there. Um, yeah. As soon as we get these guys back, we'll be able to uh, stack up on them pretty easy. Lithuania should be a non-issue in this war. Um, I assume that they're not uh, very high on the morales. Three, and we're at 4.3. So, yeah, we're good. Um, that's fine. Cool. Uh, hopefully we win this pretty soon, because I would like to get them off of my capital. They did get a wall breach, unfortunately. Um... Do I care about that? No, not particularly. Wonderful. Let's uh, Papal State. Let's go ahead and take Diplo Rep. That will help us annex them quicker. And then uh, hopefully we can win the Papacy sooner or later. So we've won the Siege of Genoa. So let's get on up there, see if we can get them off my capital. That would be best case scenario, huh? There we go, they actually ditched it, which is great. Um, let's go ahead and catch you guys out in the hills over here. Kill them all. Kill these guys over here, wonderful. The more of these little stacks we can catch, the better. Let's head on over here. Now they want a 7%. That's so dumb, dude. That is so dumb. Okay, they have 45,000 men right here. Getting onto my capital. Gonna take a bunch of attrition. They are now getting off of my capital. Uh, Wonderful. Lock in. Very good. We should be able to even stack wipe this stack here, which would be great. Uh, Wonderful. And then we can catch you guys up here in the grasslands. And uh, maybe even stack wipe you as well. Looks like we can. Where are you heading? Maybe S Switzerland's capital, maybe? Yeah, looks like it. All right, wonderful. Let's go ahead and see if we can catch them there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Wonderful. Cool. All right, so let's go ahead and have you guys spread out a little bit. There we go. Let's win back our stuff. Everything's all siege down, sadly. But uh, we've killed quite a few of their men. <laughs> Almost 60,000 men. It's crazy. We'll win all this back. We'll be good. The knights landed some men. Does not matter in the slightest because we are still going to be able to just go down and kick them out. Let's go ahead and put you over there. The sooner we win this one, the better. Get you guys off your capital. There we go. Let's actually get you guys over here. Get you guys down here. They're not going to win that siege back, so we're good. Disease outbreak, like you do. We have four cannons on there for a total whopping one artillery bonus. Okay. Switzerland, Lithuania has lost a lot of men in this war. 31,000 men they lost. This goes to show, good guys do not always finish first, man. Let's go ahead and get you guys out of there. Beautiful. Florence will no longer transfer trade power, which is a bummer, but, uh, you know, it's not the end of the world. Go ahead and speed five it for a moment. The French will like me. I will guarantee that they will like me. So 
Um, election in the despotism. So, I'm not sure what that means. So, this guy is dead. So, do we want a... Again, I don't really care particularly. So, we're now a monarchy. Yes, the 225. Marcus von Glenhausen. Gelenhausen. Very cool. We are now officially a monarchy. Or no. We are. Yes. That's so cool. And we still have high... Uh... Huh. Um... Let's go with unjustified demands. Let's go with um, man power. Let's go with autonomy change. And then I'm really big on the advisor cost. Let's take it. And then uh, sounds good. Cool, cool, cool. All right, guys. So we are now officially a monarchy, which is wonderful. Um, let's see here. Do we want to fish for any PUs? We could fish for a PU, over, yeah. but then we're gonna to switch to Sunni, so I don't know how that works actually. So let's go ahead and win this. There we go. Do we want this province here? Let's take a look here. Do we want Genoa? We could take it. We could take it. Let's go ahead and collect from there instead of Venice. Let's see what what happens. Totally. I'm going to take it. <laughs> I'm going to just do it. Um, uh, let's take a look here. So the papacy. Let's go ahead and increase relations with the papacy. Just so we don't get a unnecessary um, coalition. I'd rather we didn't get one. Do we want to royal marry Austria? Yes, we do. Let's take the uh, diplo points. That's fine. Let's go ahead. We just want to make sure that we are going to not get a coalition. That's kind of the major thing. And uh, we will take Genoa. Pope man will be pretty upset, but I think it'll be okay. We're, let's just go ahead and wait for the end of the year and uh, spend some points on this. That's fine. Gonna lose some Diplo. I don't mind that. Let's go ahead and improve relations with the Pope man some more. Uh, we are ahead, so let's go ahead and take it. That'll actually save us some money as well. Uh, I don't care about anything with the Reformation. Wonderful, we have a 224. Eh, it's okay. I wouldn't say great, but... I would not say great, but I also wouldn't say terrible. So let's go ahead and uh, Coalition will not form, I assume. Let's go ahead and make sure Mantua likes us as well. And uh, we should get very good. Wonderful. Let's go here. Yes. You will give me all of that. And there we go. Wonderful. Istrian is now mine. We can go ahead and get our guys grouped up down there. Let's go ahead and have you guys protecting trade in Genoa. And our king died already. Really? Wow. Okay, cool. Well, let's go ahead and take tech here. We are going to finish up annexing Tlemcen, and we are going to flip to Sunni. And it's going to happen soon, within the next two to three episodes, I'm thinking. So let's go ahead and, and uh, Royal Mary you. I hope you guys are enjoying. If you are, please show your support and leave a like and subscribe if you want to see some more of this content in the future. If you uh, want to check out the Discord or support what we're doing on our Patreon, the links are going to be in the description below the video. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to my top supporters on Patreon, Bloodbound92 and Palmer, as well as Jaren Clampett, Lambda Driver, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Gregory the Bitter Steel, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal 7, as well as the rest of you guys. I appreciate all of you so much. If you want to check out a couple of my other series I have going on, those are going to be linked on the left and right. And don't forget to subscribe.